Hello guys, quick tutorial on the land mine. So all you need is to create the blueprint actor and add the following components. Static mesh component to refine the model and two uh, collision uh, spheres. Uh, they both share the same collision preset. They ignore everything but overlap pawn. They have different values in their radiuses. So epicenter is a smaller one, area is the bigger one. Next thing is to add the overlap events. So, once we overlap with the area, we need to cast to our character. If the cast succeeds, then we store uh, it at the local reference so we can manipulate it later. Then we add the timer. Uh, it can be adjustable. And when the timer is up to end, it triggers the explode custom event, this one. Uh, when we add overlap with the area, we check whether we are ending overlapping with our actor and then we should clear and validate our timer. Once we are overlapping with our epicenter, we just uh, trigger the explode uh, event. So, next thing is to do the following commands. Set simulate physics on the mesh of our actor. Next, add radial impulse uh, with the origin of our epicenter and the scale uh, radius as the radius of our radial impulse. Then fall off is linear and uh, strength can be, well, it's up to you to decide which strength to define. Also, uh, don't forget to uh, check velocity change. Next, uh, spawn uh, any emitter you like and uh, after this set lifespan. So once the explosive uh, uh, is up to die, it dies. Uh, that's actually it. So, and one more thing left. Uh, to make your character act like the human, go to the player character that you have. In my case, it's third person uh, template. And here in the mesh, scroll down to the collision section and change collision preset to red doll. I hope you like this quick tutorial. I hope it was useful. Please subscribe and, as always, uh, Patreon, Discord under the video. And see you soon.